Recently, I was reading an opinion column from one of my favorite websites, Baptist News. And in it, a minister by the name of Zachary Helton, a young man, spoke about a quote from the late Martin Luther King Jr. written in 1964. Dr. King spoke in this quote of the inescapable network of mutuality. The inescapable network of mutuality. By this expression, King did not mean a kind of vague philosophy of human interdependency or an evolutionary fact that we need each other to thrive and survive. Those things are true. But this inescapable network is something even greater and more important. Dr. King's words come from a longer quote, and I want to give it to you. He said, we are caught in an inescapable network of mutuality, tied in a single garment of destiny. Whatever affects one of us directly affects all of us indirectly. How true this is. We are all affected by each other, and so goes one of us, so goes the whole of us because of this network. I'm reminded during the time of the German crisis and the rise of Nazism in the 1930s in Germany of a very well-known pastor named Martin Niemöller. Martin Niemöller chose not to raise his voice initially and even later against Nazism And when he did raise his voice, it was too late. These famous words, some of you have heard before, but I want to read them. Said Niemöller, first, speaking of the Nazis and the leaders, they came for the socialists, and I did not speak out because I was not a socialist. Then they came for the trade unionists, and I didn't speak out then either because I wasn't a trade unionist. Then they came for the Jews, and I remained silent because I was not a Jew. And then says Niemöller, they came for me, and there was no one left to speak up for me. This is the network of mutuality. We stand or fall together. Justice will not be guaranteed to me until we have justice guaranteed in a culture that ensures justice for all. As the poor suffer even more now, And as the weak are being pushed down more than ever, if we will not raise our voices because of this network of mutuality, then someday they will come for you and for me, and we will not be prepared because we have not understood and practiced the inescapable network of mutuality. May God help us to build bridges of friendship that transcend our differences and affirm our mutuality in common love, mercy, and justice for all.